How to Train a Dog, Applying General Training Principles Part 2 By When Training a Dog www.trainingadog.win 1. Be Persistent Your dog won't find out what you want from him regardless of his environment lacks consistency. Almost everyone who also lives with your dog should find out and be on board with his training intentions. For example, regardless you're training your dog not to jump on people, don't let the kids facilitate the dog jump all over them. This would weaken approximately all the training you've done. Make sure almost everyone uses the exact directions your dog finds in training. He doesn't connect English, and can't inform the major difference among sit down and sit. Using all those terms interchangeably will easily confuse him. Since he won't make a clear connection amongst a single control and a single action, his response to the command will be hit or miss. 2. Reward Successes and Good Habit Constantly reward successes and good habit with praise, and usually a small treat. Small treats help inspire your dog to find out his draining. The treat needs to be little, tasty, and immediately chewed. You don't want it to disrupt the training session or make them full too fast. Count in how lengthy it takes to chew a very difficult treat versus a semi-moist treat with like Bill Jack or Zook's Mini Naturals. Treats about the size of a pencil eraser head are enough to get the positive point across, and you don't have to wait too much for your dog to consume it. 3. Use high-value treats when preferred. When teaching hard or significant a command, implement a high-value treat to elevate the stakes for him. Examples incorporate freeze-dried liver, roasted chicken breast chunks, or slices of turkey lunch meat. As the dog finds out the command, level out the high-benefit treats and bring them back as needed to improve your training, even so often deliver him compliments. 4. Train on an empty tummy. Don't feed as huge a meal as usual a couple of hours early on training your dog. The more your dog prefers the treat, the considerably more aimed he'll be on the task he requests to execute to obtain it. 5. Always end training on a positive note. Regardless or not the training session did not move well and your dog didn't get onto a fresh command, end on something that you can praise him for. By ending the training session with a command he's currently mastered, the last factor he recalls will be your love and praise. 6. Discourage Barking If your dog barks at you when you don't need him to, just drop him right until he stops, and then reward him with praise. Often they bark at you for your attention, though other occasions it can be out of disappointment. Do not toss a ball or toy. This just teaches him that regardless whether he barks, he'll make you to do something he desires. Don't ever yell at the pet dog to be quiet, because this rewards him. Join our 100% free dog training mini course. By when training a dog www.trainingadog.win